making this video to just to understand uh, the brand of uh, brand of oil mills microinverter i'm not making this video to promote or sell any uh, <coughs> try to sell any inverter on this video if you like the video please subscribe the channel and let's begin. In 2008, uh, Hoymill was found, founded by three post doctors. In 2015, Hoymill was ranked worldwide as the most efficient microinverter in comparison with other reputed and respected, uh, respectable microinverter brand. Currently, this company is offering the safe, smarter and easier module level MPPT in over 50 countries. Most of the people from solar industry might not know about this technology, maybe it's new, but uh, uh, it's not that popular, but it has a great potential to be a market leader. Uh, as per their website, uh, this company has launched one in one uh, till one in six module, which means in single unit, you can attach one panels or a six panels as well. In fact, one in six microinverter is the world's first three-phase microinverter with a reactive power control. The one which I'm going to show you, this one, it's I'm holding HM11200, which is one in four model, so that in this device you can attach four panels together to convert DC to AC on your rooftop. Inverters uh, are just like a uh, like a your first generation phone uh, in first generation was very huge and had little functionality but now they get smaller and smaller all the time it's like a micro inverter the standard warranty period of this inverter is 144 months uh, and the DTU has is uh, 24 months as well let's talk about the technical analysis weight wise they are around 3.5 kilo also uh, integrated AC and DC cable in it it got IP65 and NEMA6 protection class. It means these inverters have been tested in minus 40 degree to 65 degree temperature. Maximum DC voltage is 60 volt and minimum DC voltage starts from 22 volt. Uh, it's safer technology since it's got a rapid shutdown technology in case of any electric shock or any fire risk at your roof. So it's very safer technology too. A static MPPT efficiency is 99.80%. Dynamic MPPT efficiency is 99.76 in overcast weather. If you are an installer and then one, one thing you should avoid uh, that unwanted power derating due to an increase in internal temperature of the inverter. So do not export it, uh, expose it to the direct sunlight. To avoid overheating, always make sure the flow or uh, there is a, always a, a flow of air around the inverter. This inverter is not blocked. Let's talk about the monitoring it got a DTU uh, in a key component in Roy Miles micro inverter system. It works as a communication gateway which operates between the Hoy Miles inverters and the Hoy Miles monitoring server. The DTU communicates with the micro inverter wirelessly and collecting the operational data of the system. Meanwhile, the DTU also connected to the uh, inverter via a router and communications with, uh, with the Hoy Miles monitoring server. The mic micro inverter system operation data will be uploaded to Hoy Miles monitoring server by DTU. So you can see each panel's production on your mobile phone and on your web browser and also you can give, uh, also see the straight away any error or a panel failure uh, issues as well. If you have done n and solar edge monitoring then uh, you can easily install this monitoring device as well. It's very easy to install and you get all the information along with the device anyways. One of the <coughs> in installer in Queensland has done the real testing. He has attached four panels of J330 with Enphase IQ7 and also he attached four panels with Hoy Mills inverter as well uh, with the same orientation, same direction and on the same roof. And through the solar and electric uh, monitoring device, we f he found that they both got a similar kind of uh, production, which is good, but Hoy Mills got a slightly more as compared to the N phase one, but at the same time, this component is cheaper as well. So, uh, so that's what you know. I wanted to explain about this inverter, and it actually comes with all the module uh, information and everything along with the unit. So you can read over there and uh, all the technical information and easy to install as well. So thank you so much for watching this video. I hopefully I may uh, I actually inf uh, I hopefully I 
help you to understand this brand and uh, yeah if you have any questions or anything please comment on uh, on, on a please comment below and uh, i will put all the description uh, in, in also in my description list and please subscribe the channel if you like the video thank you